I actually ransacked the temple. <clears throat> it was out of um, a lot of things. One, righteous anger. And two, retaliation. They killed John. I got the news. I cried. I was sad for a long time. And, I was... and then you read in the scripture that his face was set on going to Jerusalem. I went through a Mount Sinai rant and then I was like, all right, <clears throat> I'm going to see him soon. I was feeling, um, now I have 12 repentant hearts. Good. Look in the eyes, beloveds. Good. You think you're not worthy. <clears throat> I set out to be, um, well, I was a missionary in my own country, is what I was. And the best advice I ever got um, regarding life is from the hood. Because you're smarter, you're wiser, because you have to be. And um, <clears throat> they might look at you a certain way, I don't. I pull my people, I choose people that are hood. I choose you because we all got stuck in this situation as far as um, having to be strong for this, all right? And the Holy Spirit was leading me to, um, well, one, I was praying, am I going to jail? Usually if I go to a city, I visit their jail just to judge it. I did it in Medford. I spirits like, no, you're you're not going to jail. So that was one of my first things. And then Mary. To make you feel my love. No, I was watching this, right? <clears throat> This is basically how I had conversations with prostitutes and things like that. <clears throat> that is a whole different story, but... <clears throat> Would you give me a drink? You ask for a drink from me, a Samaritan, and a woman. I'm sorry. I should have said please. You know, it's not safe for you to be alone out here. Nor you. Why haven't you come with others? Why so late in the day? Don't women come to the wells in the, the cool of the morning? Yeah, well, none of them will be seen with me, so I have to come with you. In the heat, as you look so kindly to my Why won't they be seen with you? Long story. I'd, I'd still like a drink of water if you can spare it. Amazing what a parched throat will do. <laughs> Aren't I unclean to you? Won't you be defiled by this vessel? Technically, by law, Maybe yes. Some of my people say that about your women, but. I don't. Yeah? And what do you say? I say if you knew who I am, you'd be asking me for a drink. Really? And I would give you living water. Wood. So 
except that you have nothing to throw water with, and this is a deep well. Besides, what do you need from me if you have your own supply of living water? Wrong story. But Jewish water is better than Samaritan water. Hmm? That's not what I said. Are you a better man than our ancestor Jacob, who dug this well? Your water is better than his? I know Jacob. A lot of time I, I get yelled at. Uh, this water will <laughs> thirst again. But whoever drinks the water that I give him will never be thirsty again. Wouldn't that be nice? The water I give will become in a person a spring of water welling up to eternal life. Really? Yes, really. Prove it. That's usually how it goes. First, go and call your husband and then come back. I will show you both. I don't have a husband. You are right. You've had five husbands. And the man you're living with now is not your husband. Ha <laughs> oh, I see. You're a prophet. You're here to preach at me. No. Usually the one good thing about coming here alone is I can escape being condemned. This is a normal okay. response. I've made mistakes. Too many. But it's men like you who would make it impossible for me to do anything about it. How? Our ancestors worshipped on this mountain. But you Jews insist Jerusalem is the only place for true worship. They say that because the temple is there. Yeah. Exactly where we're not allowed. I'm here to break those barriers. And the time is coming when neither on this mountain nor in Jerusalem will you worship the Father. So, where am I supposed to go when I need God? I've never received anything from God, but I couldn't thank him, even if I did. Anywhere. God is spirit. And the time is coming and is now here. That it won't matter where you worship, but only that you do it in spirit and truth. Heart and mind, that, that is the kind of worshiper he's looking for. So it doesn't matter where you're from. He's talking to his daughter. Oh, what you've done. Do you believe what I'm telling you? <laughs> Until the Messiah comes and explains everything and sorts this mess out, including me. I don't trust in anyone. You're wrong. When you say that you've never received anything from God. This Messiah you speak of. I am he. The first one was named Ramin. You were a woman of purity. Who was excited to be married. But he wasn't a good man. He hurt you. And it made you question marriage and even the practice of your faith. Stop it. The second was Farzad. On your wedding night, his skin smelled like oranges. And to this day, every time you pass by the oranges in the market, you feel guilty for leaving him. His name was because Jacob. Because he was the only truly godly man you've been with. But you felt unworthy. Why are you doing this? I'm your husband. I have not revealed myself to the public as the Messiah. You are the first. It would be good if you believed me. You picked the wrong person. I came to Samaria just to meet you. <laughs> Do you think it's an accident that I'm, I'm here in the middle of the day? I am rejected by others. I know. But not by the Messiah. <sighs> As you know these things, because you are the Christ. Spirit and truth. Spirit and truth. 
it won't be all about mountains or temples. Soon. Just the heart. You promise. I promise. This man told me everything I've done. Oh, he must be the Christ. <laughs> You forgot your arm. Um, Rabbi, you got food. What would you like? Uh, I have food to eat that you do not know about. Who got you food? It's um <clears throat> a big thing. Um you tell someone that you're Jesus. You watch the reaction. Uh, you see the recognition. And then. Um, me and the Holy Spirit were talking. This morning. A lot of things. Um. About you, Mary. And, uh, um, you know, uh, <clears throat> you have a lot to say. We both do. Um, but nothing negative, all right? I love you.